Chapter 9 of Zora Neale Hurston's Their Eyes Were Watching God describes Joe Stark's elaborate funeral. People ride in in cars and on horseback, and the Elks' band plays. Afterwards, Janie burns all of her head rags in a dramatic act of defiance. She can now wear her hair as she wishes, and she decides to wear it in one thick braid. There are otherwise very few outward changes in Janie's life after Stark's death. She continues to run the store as before, only now she's able to sit on the porch and listen to the conversations. Having gained some personal freedom, Janie isn't sure what she wants to do next. In fact, she realizes that she has no interest in finding her mother and that she has hated Nanny for pushing her to pursue material comforts rather than true love. These powerful realizations represent a few of the internal changes Janie's experiencing in the wake of her husband's death. Now a wealthy widow, Janie is subjected to unwanted attention and advice. Acutely aware of her vulnerability, Janie manages to keep potential suitors at bay for six months after her husband's death. Although Janie seems to be able to do things on her own, she does get help running the store from Hezekiah Potts, the 17-year-old delivery boy who worked for Starks. Hezekiah comically imitates Starks by doing things like smoking cigars and using Joe's familiar expressions. After six months, Janie starts dressing in white to indicate that her mourning period has ended. When potential suitors come around, they treat her respectfully. But Janie refuses to let any of the men get closer to her than coming by the store. Sometimes, Janie and Phoebe go fishing, but most of the time, Janie simply enjoys her newfound freedom. Chapter 9 shows how Janie changes in the wake of her husband's death. After being married for 20 years, Janie finally has a chance to get to know herself and interact with her community as her own person. Janie begins to explore who she is as a woman, free to wear her hair as she likes, and to talk and engage with Eatonville's townspeople. She relishes these experiences. Yet Janie bears the emotional scars of enduring Starks' verbal abuse. She expects Starks to come in and find something wrong with something she did. Slowly, Janie's confidence in her abilities grows as she becomes accustomed to being on her own. In these ways, Chapter 9 deepens the theme of independence. Janie learns to be on her own and she enjoys it, and she clearly is in no hurry to marry again, despite the expectation that she'll soon find another husband. Thank you.